is John the Witness on the Mind Blowers channel, bringing you hardcore Bible facts. As one Christian website pointed out, it is sad that too many pastors have not been fully preaching about the details of the appearance of the Antichrist. On Judgment Day, Jesus Christ will hold these pastors accountable if any of their church members get led astray. So what's the problem? A lot of Christians think that just before Jesus Christ returns, the Antichrist must appear first and deceive the nations into worshiping him and accepting his 666 mark. You might say, well, isn't that what the Bible says? Yes, but that's not the problem. The problem is that Satan also knows this. Do you think he will just make it that easy for you to identify his son of perdition, the man of sin? Of course not. People wake up. One of Satan's biggest deceptions will be to make you believe his son is Jesus Christ. Did not the Bible say he can appear as an angel of light? Likewise, he can make his son appear as a true Messiah. It means that Satan will send a handsome decoy following 2,000 years of preparing his kingdom to try to match the kingdom of Jesus Christ. He didn't work all this long to let you easily reject his antichrist. He will send a decoy antichrist, a man who people are familiar with thanks to the mainstream news media. The Pope is being groomed to be such a decoy, but there are probably a few others in the works. In any case, Christians will reject the decoy. Then Satan will work signs and wonders in the heavens as the Bible warned about just before unveiling his son of perdition, the real Antichrist, who will look even more handsome and much larger than life. Given all the various chemicals being sprayed in the air, the Antichrist will use the sky to work wonders. For example, lightning flashes that will manifest in one of a few ways such as light beams or other technology. So how can you tell the difference between the real Antichrist and the real Jesus Christ? For one, all demons still tremble at the name of Jesus Christ, including the demons inside the false Antichrist and the real Antichrist. Also, Jesus Christ is coming back to destroy armies, not civilians the way the Antichrist will do to Christians. Obviously, Jesus Christ will not be giving out 666 marks either. I'm John the Witness. Stay strong in the faith of Jesus Christ. Amen.